UK YouTube channel, the channel dedicated to money and mental health. My name is Andrew. I'm a part-time eBay reseller. I'm a mental health advocate. And today I am doing a live Sourcing on a Budget special where I will be showing you uh, what I picked up in uh, one of my local charity shops straight off the £1 rail. Um, lots of clothes, spent 19 quid, I think. So plenty of... Um, different items picked up a few items that I've and brands that I've not experimented with before so it should be quite interesting to see whether any of it is actually worth any money um, looks like we've got a few people joining us in the chat now so as always we will give it a quick um, couple of minutes while we wait for um, people to join us and come and say hello and such like um doesn't look like we've got and we've got scooby shaggy with us hi scooby shaggy um a few more people coming in so yeah um normally do these sources on a budget videos um on uh pre-record but um i figured today for this one i would go live and uh, see what I picked up. Um, so I'm just going to drop a note in the Facebook group to say that I'm um, live. If you haven't joined the Money Mental Reselling group on Facebook, do give it a join. If you're on Facebook, of course, always uh, always welcoming to uh, new members, new and old resellers alike. Um, yeah cool okay so without further ado um no oh, hang on i say that i think that's i think that's done i have no clue when it comes to facebook yes it's done okay so hi tracy how are you welcome i've bought some clothes because as we know i am the great at high aid you've managed to catch me yeah i'm live with a clothing haul as i am the greatest clothing reseller ever hi ali how are you uh, ali is my local rival right let's pick out some more so let's pick out some items from this haul shall we uh right item number one everything i'm going to show you cost a quid i've no idea how much any of it is worth so we'll do some live research as well via the ebay and potentially cherry peak as well if ebay is not showing anything which reminds me i need to um, fetch up cherry peak um right so i'll get the screen share on to do 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 oh hang on i'm not seeing me i'll get the screen share on share screen so we can see what i picked up yeah live charity shop hall i bought some clothes not only advise people to buy them but i'm now the greatest clothing reseller ever because i sold some clothes so i'm uh i'll show you what i picked up on a one pound rail so item number one uh, a very fetching jeff banks shirt now ordinarily i stay away from the jeff bank stuff because it's just stuff they're doing debenhams uh, but this is triple XL shirt. This is XXXL. So large sizes always seem to do well. It is short sleeved, so it's out of season. Hi GC, how are you? Hi Ian. It's short sleeve, so it's out of season, but for a quid, triple XL shirt, Jeff Banks, I'm gonna give it a shot. Uh, we'll have a look to see if any triple XL jeff banks shirts have sold my live model well uh, i'm looking for volunteers aid definitely looking for volunteers so if you know anyone who wants to volunteer for it yeah i've got a screen share on um let me know i'll just put i can't be asked typing it out properly what have we got so there's not even any triple xl jeff bank shirts currently listed anything in sold that are new with tags so that's one's gone for about a tenner on bids 
so at the very least 9.99 without going on bids i'll probably put this on for 14.99 got to remember to do the spreadsheet uh to do otherwise i will forget all this important detail um to do ah oh, come on where's the spreadsheet Lieber office even office calc i bet it's not saved my last spreadsheet so recover that please do 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 finish what have we got that, that, that that's a quiz score sheet fetch on the spreadsheet here we go here's my spreadsheet i will save that sourcing uh clothing spreadsheet there we go right so the jeff banks shirt we're going to put on for 14.99 and see how we get on it might take a while to sound with being short sleeved but it's a really good size so it's good on the chat 13.99 yeah yeah thinking about that um son and Heron. um them ain't cheap but not always yeah that's why i only pick up the big size stuff hey laney how are you um amy's there just me hi Jimmy. i always feel slightly um uh strange saying just me i went where did i go to uh aldi i went to oh you're not talking to me sorry uh right so first item one pound into hopefully about 13.99 14.99 like uh selling heron says um they do i said lots of gc right next item sticking with the short feet shirt short, uh shirt theme anything cost me a quid well that's one english pound tracy hey donna uh, I don't normally bother with spreadsheets, but when I'm doing my research live, uh, as I am at the minute, it just saves me going back and watching the video and doing the or doing the research again, Donna. So it's purely just for the lives that I have it. Um, first item, if you missed it, was this triple XL Jeff Banks shirt, cost a quid. I'm going to list that for fourteen ninety nine. Next, we've got this very fetching. Oh, hang on. Let me just get the uh, screen share off. Uh, to do. Oh, hang on. Ah, right. There we go. Uh, next, we've got this uh, Jack Jones, who I thought was a singer, but apparently it's from Denmark. So Jack and Jones, so I assume that's some kind of brand um excel so if it's not worth anything it's in my size so i thought for a quid i'll pick it up short sleeved again so probably uh slightly the wrong time of season for it but it's quite a nice pattern on it so i figured for a quid being in my size i'll pick it up so we'll have a look again i'll do the screen share ordered my mannequin and bought first i oh, get an expired now i um that's 12.99 i'd be happy with that if it's 12.99 there uh, telling him um to do pen and paper sold in sports direct is it yeah don't surprise me um i picked up something that i know is from sports direct earlier because i've got something in but it's it's something that'll be worth uh some 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 money right get the screen share back up uh hi tommy welcome to my one pound clothing haul uh, right so jack jones xl short sleeve shirt boom be worth a million right those are not shirts those are t-shirts do why are you not bringing up shirts 
Well, that's one that's gone for about. So I'm, I'm going to take bids off. I'm going to put used on. Actually, I'll put used on. I'll leave bids on for now. Uh, to do. That's gone for a ton of, uh, ooh, seven quid. That's not great. Eight quid. Uh, 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 about a tenner. Has anyone got these things on buy it now? Let's have a look. Buy it now. Mm -hmm. £8.30 so far. Uh, that's some of this stuff's got 9.99 with postage but got an offer tenner there 8.99 plus postage yeah i'll probably um i'll try for 12.99 on it like um thailand heron suggests hi sophia not seen you for a while how are you i hope you're well um ellie's with us hi ellie dbg's here not gonna get anything done Real love reseller hi I think I said Tommy. Jack and Jones have their own shops. Excellent. Yeah, we'll do that. Twelve ninety nine. Hi Sue, how are you? Clothing haul. I've I've I'm a, I'm a new. I've even ordered a clothes steamer today. An actual clothing ste clothes steamer. Right, so I'll put that Jack and Jones shirt on for twelve ninety nine. I'll just put that on the spreadsheet. Get all these items. Cost me a quid so i'm happy that shirt well might even get worn i'm going on a possibly a singles evening either tonight or uh, either tomorrow or saturday night so i might wear that shirt for it right let's get the next item out in this mega clothing haul of 19 items to do to do I, I, right donna uh there, there have been no stunts yeah, um, I think I paid 32 quid for my steamer. It's a Von House one, which is a decent brand. They had a two-year uh, warranty with it, so I thought I'll go for that. And they're, all, they're about the same one was going for about 50 quid on Amazon with decent reviews, so I thought I'd go for that. Uh, to do... Uh, oh, real love reseller is a lady. Excellent. We'll make contact. Um, right. Next. I don't know if this is worth anything again, but again, I think this was in my size. Yeah, it's in my size. This extra large. Um, I think this is an Australian make. Hi, Derek. Bad man in Rex and maybe bad clothes and a mannequin. Um, Billabong uh t-shirt uh it was a quid and it's in my size so i figured if nothing else i can wear it but i i think billabong t-shirts have got some value in them i'm sort of hoping it's around 9.99 in decent condition anyway um so we'll have a look at that one as well see uh derek he, he tried to claim He's a big time clothing reseller earlier. Then it transpired after some investigation, he's not been paid for his uh, clothing that he sold. So he's not taking me clothes, me crown yet. Right. Billabong XL t shirt, men's clothing. Be worth a million. Ew. Oh, that's definitely gone for a tenner. I'll just uh, check I've got used on do yeah here we go used it was 950 876 six pounds 1644 which is random we've gone for like seven quid and prices all over the shop but i think 9.99 was a yeah there's there's some gone for 9.99 those have gone for 8.95 but We'll try it for 9.99 see how we get on uh to do billabong t-shirt on 9.99 excellent so we're three items in and we've already got a listed value of 
much more than I've uh, paid. Uh, just take the screen share off, catch up on the chat. Uh, to do just men's, yeah, I'm just doing men's at the minute. Don't bother with a mannequin. I'm, I might, no, I might. I was looking at some of Steve Green's um, uh, listings and his photos. He's got the same background that I have, the same fold up one um, that I'd initially bought to put behind the mannequin. But I might just hang stuff off the, off the uh, background like Steve does. But I have got a male and a female mannequin as well. So I'm going to experiment, see what works best. Um, Sailaway's in, hi Sailaway. Uh, do, do, do. Yes, I don't like spreadsheets, but I do it. Uh, there's Nikki Joe, my favourite. Hi Nikki, how are you? Uh, we're just going through my one pound clothing haul for those who have missed it. Billabong t shirt going on for a tanner. Probably won't get that for it, but I always look this reason be high and see what I can get. Uh, Jack and Jones shirt going on for 12.99. And a, an XXXXL uh, Jeff Banks shirt, which is going on for 15 quid. So, next item appears to be some kind of jumper. I don't remember grabbing this at all. Oh, some clothes. Hi, Jennifer. How are you? You're going to come tonight. Uh, everyone wants Stevie Geo back on camera. Um, do the clothes look better hanging yes donna has been uh, invited to the meetup um yes uh, yes lad media uh, after coming on my live stream yesterday bought some boots for five that are worth 130 quid i'm already inspiring people anyway this uh, new balance jumper which is genuine new balance a decent make only size small which i normally stay away from but because it is New Balance, it's got all the tags and labels in the right place and everything. Using my COVID knowledge acquired from hours of watching new to YouTube. Um, so, yeah, New Balance, small jumper for a quid. I'm not going to leave it behind. Let's see if there's any value in the New Balance jumper. Uh, right. To do... Back on eBay, New Balance jumper, small men's. Let's see what we can find out here. What? There's nothing. This cannot be. Let's take it off men's. Well, that's no good. S. Let's try S. Stupid thing. We'll go new balance jumper. So there's been loads of new balance jumpers. A uh, five ninety. That's not very good for a hoodie. Uh, so that's the sort of jumper I've got. It's gone for a tenner. So it might not be worth as much as I thought. Let's just have a look on Terra Peak. Uh, I'll pop back to the chat. Been very busy, fair enough. Oh, the chat is catching up. Oh, we're just not on Steam Yard. £12 for the jumper, yeah, I think so. Tan and Heron being washed, £8.99, £7.99. Yeah, I thought New Balance was like worth a fortune, but uh, obviously not. Make sure you check collars and armpits. I think my clothes are about five pound too expensive. I pitch it nineteen ninety nine. Hey VV, how are you? Uh, do, do, do. Right, uh, let's get back to it. Terapeak, New Balance jumper, small. I've had some sales here. Average sale price nine pound fifty eight. Do not sort of women's men's small six pound thirty, but that was an auction. 
eight pound forty three again at, at auction. Uh, I think I'll go with Thailand uh, Heron's recommendation there. Um, just take the screen share off. Twelve pound, Nicky reckons. Was it Nicky? Sorry, it said about twelve pound. Yeah, we'll go eleven ninety nine on that. I thought New Balance stuff would be worth more, to be honest, but we'll put that on for eleven ninety nine. Still right for a pound. Right, next is uh, it's because you've got to set it to um, eBay UK uh, and you've got to change the currency, Derek. So he has done a video on how to do it. Um, so if you watch, um, if you look on Sahir's channel and just type in Terra Peak, he's got a video that shows how to do it far better than I could. Uh, I followed Sahir's instructions and they worked to a T. They were perfect. Right, next, a pair of Adidas tracksuit bottoms. Um, these are the same ones that I buy. I think I paid about 23 or 25 quid even in Sports Direct for mine. Um, and these are in my size as well. So they're not likely to get sold, to be honest. Um, I'm... I'm probably going to keep these because um you know they cost 20 odd quid in sports direct but i'll have a quick look anyway to see what they're they're worth so adidas uh, i can't remember what they call these they're not tracksuit bottoms track pants or something they call them track pants um i'll give it a, give it a try anyway um put the screen share back on Uh, do hi tone how are you looking beautiful as always um right what have we got here so these adidas climber call yeah definitely keeping those for quid but um track pants search Yeah, they are trap pants. Look at that. Oh, the knowledge is coming through again. Used nine sales. 12 quid. 10 quid there for the same ones that I've got. So probably 11 99 be a fair price, I think, on those. Because um, those are size large. Those are small. Um, but I'll probably keep those as i say because they are in my uh size i do for my uh trips to the gym all right do the people do that and just end up keeping the stuff never love hate relationship with my thing uh mannequin fair enough right let's get me back on screen so you can see my beautiful face there we go Next, I picked these up purely because of the the waist size on them. Um, these Blue Harbour, which I think is Marks and Spencers. Uh, chinos, 100% cotton chinos. Again, cost a pound. Um, the waist, yeah, 42 waist uh, and 29 leg. So I think that that's a good size. Oswestry Street Rexham tomorrow. Can't be as bad as last week. Give me a shout if you want, Mark. I'm off tomorrow afternoon. I always go for a, a quick drink. Uh, if you're about in Wrexham in the afternoon. Um, so, yeah, these Marks and Spencers, Blue Harbour Chinos, 42 waist for a pound. There's got to be money um, Got to be money in them. Often they go to gyms. Never. But you never know. Um, right. So we'll get the um, screen share back on. We'll have a look here. Um, Blue Harbour. Uh, before anyone says it, no, I am not a 42-inch waist. 42. 
Well, they're going for a seven quid there, but had new attacks. Nine quid. Seven, eight quid. Uh, seven quid, not worth as much as I thought they would be then. Um, mind you, 34 results. Let's just go highest price. Let's be optimistic here. And those are all new. 17.99 uh let's just filter unused there we go 13 there were news used right brand new attacks well that's not used is it so that, that's ah forget it 9.99 plus postage 8.99 plus postage there so i could probably shoot for 12.99 eight pound 12 pound yeah that's the same sort of size so yeah i'll go for about 12.99 on them um blue harbor chinos 42.29 one 12.99 so that's cool okay and next just go back to the uh, chat. Nears joined us. I see. I'm. Uh, I'm not keeping on top of things here. Do, do, do. hi near. How are you? Uh, do, do do mail mannequin called Greg. Right. Okay. Um, so next is another pair of the blue harbor chinos um should be the same so yeah 42 waist 29 leg these are actually in um look like they've never been worn um they're in really good condition um so yeah same price for those no no point looking them up again um i may even bundle the two together um i will i always measure the clothes even though they've got a size on them just to confirm they've not shrunk and they're both the same size i may bung them together just to save on my postage costs all the prices um that i'm quoting by the way folks i include shipping in so when i'm saying 12.99 that's with free shipping i am um, do free shipping on everything my mannequin is called Manny, but I've got a new one. Uh, next, uh, I was amazed to see these on a one pound rail, and I was even more amazed to see that the genuine um, a pair of diesel uh, jeans. Um, so I'll show you some of the signs here. So we've got this on the back, but that doesn't really mean much. If we look at the studs, I don't know if the camera will focus in on this. The studs have got the sort of diesel branding on. Um, the stitching is really good quality. Um, that's proper stitching there. Nothing loose. Um, you've got the brand here. You've got, again, all the studs have got the labels on. You've got the buttons there, again, marked with diesel. Um, if you head inside all of this as it should be um that label there's a bit faded but that tells you the type of gene that it is and then you've got your care labels to check here all with the official diesel stuff on it so you know for a quid uh, amazing Clive, I like that one, Joe. That's a good name. That uh, do diesel jeans. Rupert Maud. Do, do, do. I'm just catching up on the chat. Wheelchair, get that. Mandrew, you can't be naming your mannequin after me. Right, so these diesel jeans, um, they are the Zat. 
teeny ones. I cannot remember where that. Where's the size of diesel jeans? It's on. So size thirty eight. Um, I don't know the leg length, but uh, yeah, we'll have a look. I have two female mannequins, but they have no name. Got Dolly. Uh, right, so we'll just have a quick look at the diesel jeans. I'm expecting that they should be have some decent value in them. I'm hoping they'll be my best pickup. Um, diesel. I might try the type, which I think I say it was. Yeah, Satini, thirty eight. Let's have a look. I mean, they go for 90 quid new, so second hand, they've got to be some decent money in those. Uh, used, plenty of sold used as well. Whoa! That can't be right. Have I clicked the wrong thing? Whoa! Oh, okay, so 55 quid, folks. 55 quid um 50 quid there whoa 50 quid wow 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 35 40 quid well we'll go 49.99 on those then and see how we end up well that was a pleasant surprise that wasn't it? but i thought it was worth about 20 quid um Whoa, diesel, satini, jeans, one forty nine ninety nine. There we go, bolo, bolo for you, diesel jeans. Nothing but clothing knowledge on this channel. All right, nothing else can top that. That will be the best pickup, folks. Uh, next, um, is got about forty five quid. Fair dues, Derek uh right this is why you need to come sourcing with me and rex and Mally. you get all the decent stuff next we have got guide london i don't know if this is a brand but the shirt people have told me to look for patterns so i think this is quite a nice or sort of a standout sort of pattern try and see if we can hold it out that's quite a a, a unique pattern i think for a shirt and inside it's like really good quality as well so i'm assuming it's a decent brand but again it's in my size it's the kind of shirt i would wear so for a pound i thought even if it's not worth anything it's worth something to me isn't it so we'll have a look guide london xl shirt short sleeved we'll see what we can find out i still might keep that shirt as well actually because i do like it so i might try that on later the jeans have just paid for everything anyway. Oh, I clicked on the wrong thing. Yeah, I, I like it. A nice shirt. I do well for the meetup. Hey, join us on the meetup, Jonah. I think we've had this conversation. Uh, Guy London XL short sleeve shirt. Okay, that's new. Um, so I just need to go used. Oh, it's only been one new sold. So I might have to come off the sizes, uh, which is a not a short sleeve shirt. I might take the XL out then. Whoa, seventy five quid there for um for a shirt. That's insane. Um, that's still only one new sold. So. Let's have a look on Terra Peak. Guide London XL short sleeve shirt. Search average price twelve pound and six. Um, I can't remember how to filter or uh, advanced filters. Used or pre-owned. There we go. Twenty three. 
yeah that's applied it um uh, so that's like 1677 13 but there's no point me clicking on these things that 99p plus post is our auction about a tenner there yeah i think probably 12.99 i think on that shirt then not the hitching one uh joe and the one that i'm running in birmingham on hi 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 um polar am 80 quid for some hudson jeans i'll have to look out for that i think i'll look good in that one too yeah um fashion in my house is wearing things to do my primark has all tier i'm not sure that get that rob um i'm steaming i bought a steamer for i'm steaming god i normally am steaming i bought a steamer ian to steam steam all my clothes because i figured i can use it on my own clothes as well it's for the business so yeah we'll put that guide london shirt on for 12.99 with it being short sleeved, it might struggle to sell until the summer, but I don't mind listing it and leaving it. Um, next, another shirt. Um, I may have to screen share. I just got to screen share. Oh, just get off the off the get off the screen share. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, um, I went to play back today, Rob. But they were still a five quid. When they come down to three quid, I buy them. I won't pay. I refuse to pay five quid for the shirt because I can get shirts in my size for a quid, as we've seen. Um, do do do. All right, next is a Quicksilver shirt. I've sold Quicksilver shirts before for about. 13 quid 14 quid i think so and this i really like this shirt again is it in my size and it's in my size as well so it may never make it to be sold but it's a really lovely shirt this um the feel of it is just very nice um but yeah this is a, a proper nice going out shirt by quicksilver to say i've sold their stuff before um they, i can see this shirt be i can see most of these being kept but i just like this um shirt i'm not fussed on the brand but yeah nice quick silver shirt xl modern fit whatever that means um i don't think quick silver gets faked but i'll just have a look to see if i can find the care label yeah that's um well, it's certainly the same as the one on the, the last Quicksilver shirt I sold anyway, which was only the other day, I think. Um, yeah, I'm satisfied that that's a, a real shirt. Um, but yeah, I, I genuinely might keep that shirt because it's really nice. Um, what have we got? Um, we'll have a quick look on the therapy though. Um, so how much it's worth not a uh, ebay um quicksilver that's just one word is it quicksilver on sleeve shirt boom what are you worth that's all from australia um I'll just put uk only uh do i've got about 14.95 plus postage there yeah we could probably i would probably because i want to keep it aim for 17.99 on that shirt and see what happens um to do who are you winding up now ian behave yourself on my live streams um right so I might go for $17.99 on that shirt because it is really nice and they want to keep it. All right, next. Another t-shirt. 
is this in my size? Is that why I picked it up? No, it's not my size. It's medium. Uh, it's a slogan shirt, but it, the slogan appears to reflect the brand. So I don't know if it's a brand or not. But it looks like it's hardly ever been worn. I am defected. It says on the T-shirt. And then defected appears to be the brand it's all on the back like uh, and everything like i'm speaking like i'm from Wrexham now the people say like in buckley after every sentence ali if you're still watching um i am defected um t-shirt oh defected is the brand um i have no idea if that's a decent brand or not but it looked like a quality t-shirt so I figured for a quid, I'll take a look for it. it. Looks like people have searched for it anyway. Forty-three results for defected T-shirt, uh, but they all. Or is it bringing up defect? That's annoying. Right, let's see if we can find anything that's got. can't find anything here in the souls no I'm not finding anything in the souls there we'll just have a look if anything's listed I have got UK only of course on my search so it may not be from the UK to do perfect defect that's not it hmm interesting i've picked up a brand that doesn't exist yeah there's nothing there um i'll just have a quick look in therapy has anyone heard of this defected a fairly big in the club music zone scene okay that would make sense because i've got another t-shirt that i think is in the same size it's definitely a club sort of music thing so that might have some value to it then um i'll have a look on Terapeak. i just hope it doesn't look for defect so it's on Terapeak. defected records interesting that could be it that's how will this listing come up yes it will interesting so this could be defected records then so that's gone for about a tenner on bids i don't i don't know if that's the same thing i don't know if that's the same thing um oh here we go i am defected that's what i've got which has gone for one pound one on bids and won't come up because it went too long ago. Well, at least there's been one sold, which has gone for one pound plus three pound shipping, so four quid on bids. So it's got to be worth at least a tenner. Um, I'll just see if there's anything on Google. Uh, yeah, defected records, house, spot on, Rob. that's the t-shirt there except i've got the white version interesting so that's going to require further research but we're going to say at least 9.99 for that house records one 9.99 question mark further research on google okay cool back to the um chat oh hang on i didn't have any of that on screen share then did i have you missed the screen share now i'll just show you uh hang on what have we got dax don't know what dax is uh yeah i'll just show you on the screen share what i found so i didn't find anything on terra peak apart from this one t-shirt here which had gone for one pound one 
plus shipping on bids. Um, but looking on Google, defected.com, this is the same t shirt but black. Um, so it's and it's defected records. Um, so yeah, it, it's obviously a, a thing. So you spot on there, Rob. Um, oh, 20 quid. There you go. So 20 quid for a new one. So I, I, I feel reasonably confident in yeah, bespoke house music and apparel. I feel reasonably confident in going for 9.99 then 50 percent about fair on a second-hand product so I, I, I don't need to do any more research on that as such uh, next um again i'll just come off the screen share Dax Blazer, excellent. So who's got, so have you picked up, you know, not any luck with Dax of London, men's blazer, pay the tenner, looks brand nice. Do you want me to look in Terra Peak then, do you? Um, Dax, men's blazer. Have I still got the screen share on? Yeah, I have, yeah. All right, I'll a peek. Oh, there's hundreds being sold. Have you got a size on it? 70 quid there for a cashmere one. Um, plus shipping. £8.46 shipping they've charged on that, apparently. So it's gone for about 75 quid there. Um, most of these are on bids. Fixed price, that's 30 quid, but that's just a, a wool one. So if you got, did you say, what did you say you had in it? Oh, I'm in the wrong thing. To do 45% wool, 55% silk. I'd say 69.99 based on what I'm seeing there. You know, maybe 59.99. Um, 44 XL, yeah, I think 66.99. Um, Fair price. Uh, right, next. They was uh, talking about this in the charity shop to me. Um, they all admired this T-shirt. So it's quite strange, actually. So it's got this picture of a dog on it. But what first tried it to me was it's Adidas. So don't Adidas do like an Adidas Originals range or something? Well, strange, anyway. Um uh, not your standard Adidas T-shirt. Um, Adidas Rita Aura, apparently. And it's a UK 14, so it's a ladies' T-shirt. Okay. So they've put that in with the blokes by mistake. Um, Adidas Rita Aura T-shirt. But well, that's got to be worth something, hasn't it? I mean, I picked it up because it's a quid. It's Adidas and had a dog on it. Um but having that Rita Aura on it as well, she's like a singer, isn't she? Uh, night, uh, double karma, take care. Um, so let's um, get the screen share on. Adidas Rita Aura t shirt. So the tracksuit chops go for quite a bit but this is a t-shirt why are you bringing up tracksuit tops um, let's go further down uh, I can't see one like I've got but that's gone for 12 quid which is fair enough um, that's gone for 20 quid. Um, 
I see if anyone's got any listed. Uh, it's cut off solds. I've got the screen share on, haven't I? Yeah, I have. Yeah. So that's the T-shirt I've got. I'm brand new. It's fifty quid. So twenty quid, probably achievable on that. Um, well, I don't know actually if they've sold any of that price. So let's have a look. It says free available. Doesn't say that they've sold any, but uh, that's fifty four ninety nine. That's a short set. Uh, do. Don't seem to be see brand new one for twenty three quid. That those have um, doesn't seem to be one listed like it either. So I'm gonna probably shoot quite high on that. Um, let me just see what the doggy print. Let's have a look. Adidas, it is Adidas originals, like I thought. Adidas Rita or a dog e. First time I typed doggy into something and it's not been rude. Uh, any fun therapy? No results. Let's put dog. Ah, oh, stuff it. If it's going for 50 quid, I'm going to put it on for 40. Uh, not 40, sorry, 24.99 and see what happens. A bit of a lucky pickup, considering they put it on the wrong neighbour and on wrong thing, and I never checked the ladies' clothes. I'm happy enough with that. Um, let's take the screen share off. All right, night, Joan. Take care. Uh, go for thirty, best offer. You reckon twenty nine ninety nine? Go big or go home. I guess DBG. We'll do it. Twenty nine ninety nine. Why not? So that's hopefully a good little pickup there as well. That means I can keep even more of the clothes for myself. Um, do you just say no? Double check for a fake. Um, so for me, Adidas. Uh, standard places I would check. Obviously, you got that on the front. That's neither here nor there label there is well put it this way it's the same as the one i've got on all my adidas stuff um should be a label on the side yeah label on the side yeah that's all right um care label uh, yeah don't know if that'll focus in but we've got the hologram with the branding etc and all the stuff on the labels so yeah i'm happy that that's a real one um i probably check those in the shop as well so yeah after that for a quid and then next still more coming out here so this sourcing on the budget is going well. Um, uh, a lightweight jacket for a quid. Uh, genuine, I checked this. Genuine Nike uh, lightweight jacket. Unfortunately, well, I don't. I don't know if it's in my size or not. Um, it might be. It's um, it's got US eighteen to twenty written on it, so I suspect it's a ladies' jacket. It's UK uh, uh, EU one six four to one seven six. That means nothing for me. And then it says XL. So I don't know if it's um, a ladies' one, but again, satisfied that it's a genuine Nike product. We've got labels there. A well stitched um, label on the back there. Um, yeah, 30 best offer. Um, 
the zip feels really good quality and again it's got the Nike logo on it and the care labels a little bit faded um, but again got the relevant stuff on it uh, so yeah satisfied that that's a genuine Nike jacket just not sure on this sizing um, so I might need to look that up but we'll go have a look on the uh, eBay uh, oh hang on right do like lightweight jacket men's clothing oh, I've gone on uh, new there haven't I four cylinder results um, used and sold right yeah got a lot of um stuff on there but we'll scroll down that was a waterproof ones do 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 Possibly not going to see anything similar to this. Possibly will. Don't know. Because uh, I don't know if it's men's or ladies, to be honest. Um, what have we got here? Those are hooded jackets. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's further down the page. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything like what I've got. Uh, no, not confident. Uh, I'll probably say, looking at these prices, that I'll put it on for nineteen ninety nine. But I need to check if it's men's or ladies. I'll just do a Google on the. Um, numbers that are on it that'll tell me when i've got the time uh to do how hot it's been to do ah oh, the suntan uh the sunburn see us have been coming expensive yeah doing all right with mine so far next um a Berghaus, I don't know how you say it, but I go Berghaus fleece. Uh, it's only size small, but for a quid, I'm not going to leave it watching on a massive TV. Does it show that? Well, you, 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 you've you typed in the chat, Haggis Lover, so I, I'm assuming you've done something, but if you're watching it on your telly, the only way to join the chat I'm aware of is on the mobile. Hey, uh, everyone, how's it going? Oh, you found, yeah, lo lots of stuff, Marshall. Lots of stuff. Um, we've had a 50 quid pair of jeans that cost a quid come out. A Rita Ora shirt that's worth about 20 odd quid, hopefully, come out. So, you know, we're, we're doing well so far. Um, Berghaus, 11 items for £10. But they might only be without rags. Well, you never know. You're not going to go far wrong spending a tenner, are you? So, Berghaus, um, fleece, size small, it's good condition. It's got to be money in that. It's got to be. I mean, I'm well into profit on this haul anyway, but again, we'll have a look. Um, we'll go full screen. Do, 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 do. Berg house. Place small. Uh, I'll just make sure I put used on. 62, so there's plenty sold there. Those are the jackets. Is that the same one I've got there that's gone for 30 quid? Uh, it looks very similar. So that's similar to the one I've got there that's gone for 30 quid. Um, 
that one there 20 quid that's about the same yeah so you know about 20 quid so i don't know whether to go halfway there what do you reckon people in the chat do i put it so that's gone for 30. it's gone for about 20 but i mean it's it's on somebody's carpet so it's not the best look really i'm assuming there um let's just have a look i mean there's not a lot of pictures there i'm probably going to shoot for 24.99 on it folks i think um yeah i'm going to go for 24.99 on that fleece so again another excellent pickup i'm all right at doing this clothing business so yeah i'll do that um all right next and i got the screen share back off behave it's not jk's is it jk did he used to wear did he wear him i don't know um right next um this again it's a slogan t-shirt it cost a quid it says get out on it but it's a uh, nike agc whatever that is it's got it on the back as well so we've been a slogan t-shirt from a recognized brand i thought i may as well go for that did i check the care label on this one i can't remember yeah the care label have been cut out on it which is annoying um i know i'm not too worried about it being cut out because i can feel from the quality of the t-shirt itself that this is really good quite i'm wearing a primark t-shirt at the minute and I, the difference in how this feels compared to how this feels is unreal um they've obviously just cut it out because it's been rubbing against them but uh yeah um no idea what uh that ajc stuff is all about um but we'll have a look nike agc get out see if that comes up with anything no okay i'll just type in t-shirt oh because i don't go for great well i don't know if those are used um oh, i got solds on here Put solds on. Have I got the screen share on? No, I haven't got the screen share on. All conditions gear. Thank you, Rob. That makes sense to me. Um, right. AGC t shirt. So that's logo one, 1750 blessed offer. Um, I'll just get. Have I got used on? 25 have gone used, so that feels like that, that, that's a good sign that these things do sell. Um, I do have, highest price. So some gone for about, about 20 quid. So that's gone for 20 quid on bids. Fifteen pounds. I have a slogan on as fifteen ninety nine is fair. Um, One pound nineteen ninety nine. Okay. So let's put that one on the pile. Oh, I've had a message from Nick. I'll reply to that later. Um, do apologies, Nick, if you're watching live ignored you there um right next item of clothing i don't I have no clue what this is oh a night running top 
these these are probably going to go well, aren't they? You know, post Christmas. Uh, but yeah, it's a nice nice running top. It's in really good condition, to be fair. Whoever's bought it, I really don't think they've worn it to go running in very often. Um, Nike running, dry fit top, size medium for a quid. I'm pretty sure I've bought running tops before and paid about a tenner or so for them used. But we'll have a quick look. Uh, to do. Dry fit. Um, running top men's clothing whoa a lot gone on souls anyway uh some of them seem to go for serious money uh i got used on whoa 614 i'm gonna have to narrow down the size here uh medium still 213 Uh, do that's the same one I've got. It's gone for twenty five quid on bids. Um, so yeah, they're going for about twenty five quid on bids. Yeah, um, I'll just have a look at that. Actually, that's got a zip on it. I haven't got a zip on mine, have I? That could be the difference. Yeah, I've definitely not got a zip on it. Has that got a zip on it? Let's have a look. Yeah, that's a zipped one. So it's probably why it's gone for a bit more. Uh, to do. Yeah, half zip there. That's more like the one I've got, which is 20 quid there. 20 quid plus three quid postage. I mean, that's gone for about 20 odd quid there i think yeah 20 quid yeah i think 19.99 for this fair price which is more than i i was thinking it'd be worth about a tennis so i'm very happy with that um back to the chat I mean, to do. It's because Ian's too old for the army now. Ian's like 75 now. He's not really, but yeah. Autumn and winter to do. <laughs> TBG ain't coming on call. The camera is doing it. Oh. My media source will be, is retiring soon, so this is why I'm exploring new markets. Next, I know this is genuine because I've got loads of them the same. So a while back, Sports Direct were banging these out for about 15 quid, and this is one of them. It's a, a Tommy Hilfiger polo shirt, size large, so unfortunately just a size too short for me. But I've got I've I've got a wardrobe full of these because I bought them all in when I run cheap in Sports Direct, and that's where this has come from. It's exactly the same as the ones I've got. So a nice Tommy Hilfiger red polo shirt in size large. Didn't even need to think about picking that up. Um, probably twelve ninety nine at least I reckon for it. Um, but. That's off the top of my head. I'll have a look now. We'll do some more research. Uh, to do. So, Tommy Hilfiger. Polo shirt. Large red. Because I think there'll probably be quite a lot of these. Right, I mean, I'm going to have to filter on used. Yeah, 47. I'm not surprised at all that there's quite a lot there. I'll have to put it on UK as well. Uh, UK only. Right. 
Um, that looks like the one I've got. Uh, actually, this gone for 20, 18 quid plus. I mean, that's more than they cost in Sports Direct. And yeah, that's the one I've got. Um, and this is in, you know, it looks hardly warm. Yeah, that's the one I've got. It's gone for 18 quid plus 3.99 shipping on bids. Might have had a bit of a bidding more on that by the looks of it. So I'm just going to see if I can find any others. Uh, yeah. That's the same one as well. 15 quid. Which is what the that's £10 plus shipping. That's the same one I've got. It's gone for 12 quid on bids. So I'm probably going to shoot for 19.99 on it, which is more than they cost in Sports Direct. But um, Tommy Elfiger, Polo, £1.19.99. I'm happy with that. I think that's a reasonable price. To do same age as Nick. Yeah, I know. All right. Uh, behave yourselves. Right. Okay. Well, nearly had a chat answer, and I think. Oh no, there's still more. Next item is a gap hoodie. Um, gap men's hoodie, size medium, in blue. Again, cost a quid. Conditions all right, decent enough. Um, we'll have a look, see what these are worth. Do 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 Gap, hoodie, medium, blue. I think there's probably loads of gap hoodies being listed. Um, just narrow it down to men's. Uh, to do so, nine results gone for about a tenner. Um, yeah, about a tenner. just have a look um, take the size off it is that the sort of style yeah it's that sort of style that's gone for what I got used on yeah not everyone's put the colour in the title uh, 15 quid maybe Yeah, I could shoot for maybe twelve ninety nine. I might shoot for fourteen ninety nine on it. It'd be optimistic. Stuff it. There we go, right, I'm back on the stream. So, yeah, we'll shoot for 14.99 on that. One more item to go. Whew. Oh, no. More than one item, there's still more. So this T-shirt, again, a slogan T-shirt. This is a band T-shirt. I've always been told to pick up band t-shirts. 
says truth is a beautiful thing on it um it is official merchandise of london grammar whoever they are i thought it was a school uh but then it's got music venues on the back of it so it's obviously a band called london grammar um so yeah uh 2017 so it's not vintage or anything but i thought again there's got to be uh some money in this gospel choir don't know no idea laney no idea um well we could have a look actually can we we could google uh london grammar pop band apparently um so yeah they're a band um right so if we look for london grammar t-shirt we got the screen share on yeah i have yeah chief is a beautiful thing it seems to be a name of something so 10.99 there that one's gone for don't know if that's new or not new without tags apparently and then four quid um for a tour one there um i'll just have a look and see what's listed not on souls lows listed there um pre-owned yeah i mean i'm gonna shoot for 9.99 on it i've no idea whether i'll get anything like that but they seem to be quite popular new so why not Nine ninety nine. All right. Okay. Uh, to do. Let's go back to the chat. To do. Uh, how do I do this? Get inside. Right. And then the final T-shirt. Again, no idea. If there's anything in this. It sort of looked like it might be something. So this T-shirt um, says BCK and HRSY Function, whatever that is. I mean, it's Beck and Hersey is the brand, apparently. So that was a quid. I thought, again, it's got to be something in it. I don't know if that, I've never heard of Beck and Hersey, but let's have a look. Rod, hi, Adam, how are you? You've just come in at the end, mate. Um, to do. So, Beck and Hersey t shirt. Final item. Hersey t shirt. There we go. So, people have searched for it at least. Thirty-two results. Okay, so that's promising. Um, yeah, twelve ninety-nine. Are they new though? Or what's just the? Uh, yeah, the lot new. Used ten. Okay, this could be bad news. Only on bids. Seven pound twenty. Um, that's the one I've got there, which has gone for about seven quid. On bids though, so. I'm going to shoot for 9.99 on that as well. Um, 9.99, job done. So, total spend. Save the spreadsheet. Well, they've only charged me 19 quid, but apparently I've got 20 items, so they must have miscounted there i'll whack another quid in the donation box next time i go there 
Um, so yeah, total spend was nineteen pounds. Uh, listed value three hundred and forty eight pounds. Apparently, that can't be right. That's sure, right. We're going to get the calculator out. No way that could be three hundred and forty eight quid. No way. Not from a less than twenty quid investment. Come on, calculator. Fourteen ninety nine plus twelve ninety nine plus nine ninety nine plus eleven ninety nine. Let's, let's press that again because there's two plus twelve ninety nine. And again, there's two plus forty nine ninety nine plus twelve ninety nine plus seventeen ninety nine plus nine ninety nine twenty nine ninety nine. Sorry, folks. I don't trust this spreadsheet. Nineteen ninety nine twenty four ninety nine nineteen oop nine nine that's the first one. And there's another one another one plus fourteen ninety nine yeah, see, I knew this spreadsheet was wrong. Three hundred and forty-eight pound eighty, which is what it said. Oh my God, three hundred and forty-eight pound eighty listed value um, from a nineteen quid investment. Right, that's it. I, I forget about media. I'm doing clothes all the way. That's unreal. Yes, I found the game, Martin found it shipped it because i am the best that's chloe best reseller ever oh so yeah 19 quid into 340 obviously that's listed value i will have best offer on um yeah i'm i'm, I'm just go gonna say that's the listed value what a best offer on um obviously shipping will come out of that eBay fees will come out of that, but again, from twenty quid, you know, could be looking at a couple hundred quid profit, hopefully after shipping fees, etc. So yeah, well happy with that um, that haul. Well happy. So uh, yeah, clothing. Uh, who knew? Apparently, it's worth money. Um, so yeah. Always check out the one pound rail in your clothing uh, in your charity shops because, as I've just shown, you can get some some cracking pickups there. I've got uh, this weekend. I'm going to be sorting out my new photography slash YouTube studio. A spare room is going to be turned into where I'm going to film. We're going to photograph all my clothes. We have proper proper setup. We're going to take this stuff seriously because the money is there to be to be made. Um, so yeah anyway i'm gonna um i'm gonna uh yeah yeah i'm coming out of the video games market i'm going clothing that nah, that's mad now nah, i'm gonna stick with i'm gonna do both uh my plan this year uh, next 12 months is to gradually build up my knowledge around clothing yeah i might do some live listing on it once i've sold out the studio i might do a little like video showing the studio which i'll upload once it's sorted little tour and then um, i might do some live clothing listing um to show how i'm sort of doing it but yeah yeah um so hopefully uh that's uh, inspired you to, to you can on a limited budget still source and get some decent pickups you've been watching money mental uk I'm live on youtube in my bedroom thanks all for joining us and i'll see you all again soon take care
Bye for now.